the channel so here we are discussing the problem sum in binary tree so the problem states that when you are really like math one day when he was solving another math problem he came up with an interesting tree this tree is built as follows initially the tree has only one vertex with number one the root of the tree then one year adds two children to it assigning them consecutive numbers two and three respectively after that he will add children to the vertices in increasing order of the numbers starting from two assigning their children the minimum unused indices as a result one year will have an infinite tree with root in vertex one where each vertex will have exactly two children and vertex numbers will be arranged sequentially by layers so as you can see here the vertex numbers are arranged as follows now what we need to do we need to find the sum of the vertex on the path from the number 1 which is the root to the vertex with number n and n is provided us as the input so suppose we take vertex 3 which is our first input so if we go to vertex 3 what we have we can directly go from 1 to 3 hence the sum would be 1 plus 3 for the next test case which is 10 we can go to 5 then to 2 then 1 so the sum would be 1 plus 2 plus 5 plus 10 which would give us 18 so now let's understand the logic i hope you all are getting the logic now so whatever the node is there you know that it is sequential so if the node is odd then it is divided by 2 and it leads to another number and if this number is divided again it leads to another number and these numbers are forming layers of the node as you can see so we can just add these numbers and get the solution so what we can do suppose we have 12 as a node let's take this so what is 12 by 2 6 so we add 6 in our result first we have added initially 12 then we add 6 in our result now what is 6 by 2 6 by 2 is 3 so we add 3 now what is 3 by 2 we are taking the integer division remember so 3 by 2 is 1 adding these we have 4 plus 6 10 10 22 so this gives us the result as 22 so our path sum is 22 here now let's see how 18 was coming so it is 10 plus 10 by 2 which is 5 plus 5 by 2 which is 2 and 2 by 2 which is 1 hence it gives the answer 18 now as you can see if you are having an odd number like we have 13 here and we divide it by 2 it moves to its parent node and also if we have even number and we have integer division it leads to the parent node like this we are traversing parent to parent and hence we reach the root so i hope you all understand the solution thanks for watching